Hello, welcome to the Memento M. Cristo channel. Psalm 5 and 6. Apocalypse 5. And I saw a powerful agent proclaiming in a great voice, who is worthy to open the book, and to loose the seals of it. And none in heaven above and nor on the earth nor under the earth was able to open the book or to see in it. And I wept much because none was found worthy to open the book or to see in it. And one of the elders says to me, Weep not, behold, the Lion of the tribe of Judah, the Root of David, overcame to open the book and the seven seals of it. And I saw in the midst of the throne and of the four beings, and in the midst of the elders, a lamb standing, like it had been killed, having seven horns and seven eyes, which are the seven spirits of God being sent forth into all. And he came and took it out of the right hand of him who sits on the throne. And when he took the book, the four beings and the twenty-four elders fell down before the Lamb, each having a harp and golden bowls containing incense, which are the prayers of the sanctified. And they sing a new song, saying, Thou art worthy to take the book and to open the seals of it, because thou were killed and purchased us from God by thy blood, out of every tribe, and tongue, and people, and nation. And thou made them kings and priests to our God, and they will reign over the earth. And I looked, and I heard as a voice of many agents all around the throne and the beings and the elders. And the number of them was ten thousands of ten thousands, and thousands of thousands. Saying with a great voice, Worthy is the Lamb that has been killed to receive the power, and wealth, and wisdom, and strength, and honor, and glory, and blessing. And every creature that is in the heaven, and on the earth, and under the earth, and is in the sea, and things in them all, I heard saying, The blessing, and the honor, and the glory, and the dominion is to him who sits upon the th. And the four beings were saying the truly. And the elders fell down and worshipped. Apocalypse 6 And I saw that the Lamb opened one of the seven seals. And I heard one of the four beings saying like the sound of thunder, Come and see. And behold, a white horse, and he who sits on it having a bow. And a crown was given to him, and he went forth conquering, and so that he might conquer. And when he opened the second seal, I heard the second being saying, Come. And another horse came forth, fiery red. And it was given to him, to him who sits on it, to take peace from the earth, so that they would kill each other. And a great sword was given to him. And when he opened the third seal, I heard the third being saying, Come and see. And behold, a black horse, and he who sits on it having a balance in his hand. And I heard a voice in the midst of the four beings saying, A measure of wheat for a denarius, and three measures of barley for a denarius. And thou may not harm the olive oil and the wine. And when he opened the fourth seal, I heard the fourth being saying, Come and see. And behold, a green horse, and he who sits on top of it. His name was Death, and Hades followed with him. And authority was given to him over the fourth part of the earth, to kill with sword, and with starvation, and with what is dee. And when he opened the fifth seal, I saw underneath the altar the souls of those who had been killed because of the word of God, and because of the testimony of the Lamb that they held. And they cried out in a great voice, saying, Master, holy and true, how long did thou not judge and avenge our blood from those who dwell on the earth? And a white robe was given to them each, and it was said to them that they should still rest a time, until also their fellow bondmen, and their brothers, and those going to be killed as they too, would be fulfilled. And I looked when he opened the sixth seal, and a great earthquake occurred, and the sun became black as hairy sackcloth, and the whole moon became as blood. And the stars of the sky fell to the earth as a fig tree that casts its unripe figs being shaken by a great wind. And the sky departed as a scroll being rolled up. And every mountain and island were moved out of their places. And the kings of the earth, and the rulers, and the chief captains, and the rich, and the strong, and every bondman and freeman, hid themselves in the caves and in the rocks of the mountains. 
And they say to the mountains and to the rocks, Fall on us, and hide us from the face of him who sits on the throne, and from the wrath of the Lamb. Because the great day of his wrath has come, and who is able to stand? Subscribe to the channel and leave your like.